Lex is a very passionate person. He does things because he strongly believes in them. He's taken issues and has brought in people that can talk about them very thoroughly. And Lex himself knows these things as well. He's very, very smart. He's very in tune to what's going on and, and what rights uh, uh, and opportunities are available to everyone. And he, he feels that everyone should be afforded these opportunities. And so he brings in people to talk about them, to make people aware in the community that these services are available to you and you can still do this despite uh, uh, your situation and that's what Lex does. Lex has done so much over the years. He, he's an incredible person. I mean, he will take every opportunity to, to uh, showcase an issue or uh, take up a topic for example. He's had people that have flown in from everywhere and we'll go to wherever he is, we'll do the shows and we'll do one or, and or two shows. Um, he's always ready to do un, one show and put the other show in the can for another day. <laughs> Lex sits on our Disabilities Task Force, which is made up of about 26 operating departments from pilots to interior engineering to customer service to in-flight uh, flight attendants to the marketing department to the advertising department to the public relations department to the legal department. We meet as a group every quarter and Lex is a member of that group. And we go over what we've received in the way of complaints, what projects we are working on, and what laws have changed that are gonna require us to modify or improve the service we give to people with disabilities. And he plays a very important role in that. There's two ways to get an airline to provide service. One is to work with us, and one is to demand things that are unreasonable. Lex takes the positive approach and makes us wanna provide that service and that's the best way to do it. Normal work day with, Le with uh, Lex, and um, he's not here every day, but when he's here, Lex, it's very frenetic, fast-paced. Lex is always full of um, different ideas and different things, and it never ceases, all these years that I've known, it never ceases to, me, to amaze me when I want to bounce an idea off of him, and he comes back with um, a thousand you know, different ways to you know, carry something out. And also when something's happening and um, he's working on, um, on a new project, perhaps on a new grant, um, anything. I mean, it just amazes me the things that he's able to come up with. So um, a day with Lex, it's just, it's fast paced. It's hard to, sometimes it's hard to keep up with him because he doesn't like long meetings. He wants to, he likes to move things along he, because he's got so many things going on. So it's constant teleconference calls, constant, like I said, there's five, 10 minute meetings to, to get through things and you know, um, but it's, it's always exciting because he's always, he comes with um, new ideas, very innovative, different, that, um, things that I think other people never would have thought of. Well, I, since we were doing a video, I thought I could start off by telling you about the joys of Lex that I recently read. And uh, boy, I've met so many joys of Lex. Uh, Lex Frieden is not only a joy to know, but he's also... Um, coincidentally has a wife named Joyce that is a big part of his life and his success. Lex is one of those people who not only has changed the world but continues to change the world. He's obviously not only living his work and his vocation but I see something spiritual about what he's done for hundreds of thousands of people. In essence he's enabled them to have jobs, to have careers, to go to places that before this piece of law told them that they weren't welcome there. Uh, for that, he will not only go down in history, but he's created a lot of uh, advocates and um, soldiers in the field of removal of barriers for people with disabilities. On behalf of Barbara and myself, I'd like to congratulate Lex for receiving this well-deserved honor tonight from the River Performing and Visual Arts Center. I first met Lex Frieden before I served our nation as president. His input and his counsel helped produce the original draft of the Americans with Disabilities Act, and he was right there with me when, as president, I was privileged to sign the ADA into law. 
You know, Lex has made a huge impact on our nation's disability communities, and by gracious and humble example, he's helped our nation. He's helped it understand that people with disabilities not only deserve, but are guaranteed equal rights to access, employment, and all the opportunities every American has. He's a champion for the children of the river, whose lives are already better off thanks to the work he did well before they were born. Congratulations, Lex. Tonight, as always, I'm proud to have the privilege to call you a friend.